Being in the South Bay now have one less excuse not to wear a mask. News 8's Chris Groh is live in Chula Vista with what the city is doing now so its residents are protected from the coronavirus. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, and this may seem like secondhand knowledge pretty much by now to always be carrying a mask or facial covering with you, especially when you're out in public, when you can't maintain that six feet of social distancing. But as you just heard there, Latino community disproportionately hit hard by COVID-19 and the South Bay Chula Vista, no exception to that. So that's why you're seeing this push here from the Chula Vista government to help make sure that everyone is informed, not only that these masks are available, but also that they are effective. Now there's going to be about 25,000 of them handed out on a first come first serve basis. So they even have the Chula Vista logo printed on it, but more importantly, the Chula Vista website that's printed there so that it could spread the word about where residents can go to get information about COVID-19 safety and precautions. Now, Mayor Mary Casilla Salas told us she is urging residents to wear these facial coverings for the protections of others. She said the community has endured long enough and it's time for everyone to do their part. The masks are really essential uh, to the public health of everyone. And we know that masks are effective, they work. When I wear the mask, it protects you. And when you have your mask on, it protects me. And so take a look at your screen. These are the locations where you can get that mask Monday through Friday at either the Civic Center Library on F Street, where we are right now, or the Otay Ranch Library on Birch Road. Now, also near where we are, the police station, police officers, park rangers, and firefighters that are going to be out and about, they will be giving out masks to people in public that don't have them, uh, that are without them. Again, Chula Vista is urging residents to always be wearing these facial coverings when in public and when they cannot socially uh, distance from others and all in an effort again to curb the spread of COVID-19.